Hello there, this is yours truly, the CLJ, outside of my office and into somewhere else. I don't know where am I, but I'm here, yours truly, in your face, and hope y'all doing good and all that. Coming at you with a very candid and literally out of the blue, cinematical CLJ, about the another cancellation of the MCU Blade that's supposed to star in Martha Shala Ali as Blade. And for the fifth time, the fifth time, number five, number five, five years, it was originally uh, you know, introduced at the San Diego Comic Con in 2019. 2019, ladies and gentlemen, about the uh, about a reboot of Blade that originally starred the super Hollywood action blockbuster star Wesley Snipes, who really saved it Marvel's bacon back in 98 when they was bankrupt to the ends of the earth near, it was near Event Horizon, people. But that movie, it won. It got them out of the hole, got them out of the Event Horizon, and boom, it's what you see now. There would be no MCU if it wasn't for Blade. It would be no X Men. It would be no Iron Man if it wasn't for Blade. For Wesley Snipes, what he did in '98. So the MCU decided, okay, you know, eleven years later, let's go and reboot Blade with with Martha Shala Ali and crickets, crickets, cancellation, not. It's just, it's terrible. It really is. New writers over the last five years have been nothing but rewrites, reshoots, cancel that, cancel that. Re, uh, new director, X. New producer, X. Can't. Remember, Martha Shala Lee is just sitting here waiting just to, you know, because he's going to do that movie justice. They know this, but why are they over here twiddling their, dumb, their thumbs and just saying, hmm. Mm, we will do it one day. We will do it. You know what this is starting to remind me of? This is this is the same thing how the MCU did to Black Widow, a movie that should have been in 2017 after, a year after Civil War, but then they waited until post-Endgame in 2021, which was pointless. They killed the character off, only to have a movie about her that takes place before. What kind of nonsense is that? What kind of a carriage before the horse is that? So it seems like that they're pulling this off with MCU Blade. It's just, mm, you know, maybe people will forget about it. And then there's another thing that just reminds me of. We're going to the gaming field. Duke Nukem Forever, which took like almost 15 years just for a piece of crap. So, yeah, MCU, shame on you all because the, what phase, phase five that, that, uh, that they're on now and no Blade. Still five years. Meanwhile, Deadpool Wolverine. Meanwhile, all the Spider Mans. Meanwhile, the End Game. I mean, the uh, the Infinity Saga. This was announced during the end of the Infinity Saga. This was announced during Phase Three, I believe. Phase Three, and still now it's being canceled. You know, now it's being delayed to twenty twenty five, and they might as well just put a fork into it and just quit with it. Because they also did Wakanda Forever wrong by not recasting T'Challa because Chadwick Boseman, his brother, said it. He said that, you know, you know, Boseman, you know, rest in peace, but you know what? You're in a better place. You're a better body. You with the Lord being glorified. He would want to, you know, T'Challa Black Panther to be replaced by another actor. Yes, because it's the character, not the actor. And Dizzy just said, well, you know, we don't Let's just throw this on the Barbie and see if people going to eat it up. And we didn't because of the MCU. Shame on you. Mm-hmm. So here we go again. And, and uh, another thing, you know, special shout out to, a, you know, to a, to a social media brother, you know, pro-black FBA brother, to Tori and Reigns. Here to you, brother, for bringing that news up. And yes, you know, uh, to your quote, poor Johnny, I mean, poor Jonathan Majors. Which was, by the way, we all know why he didn't get the Johnny Depp treatment because of his tone. Yeah. 
it's practically the same thing we think about it. Everybody had justice for Johnny Depp, but everybody was crickets and told something, let's condemn John the Majors. We all know why, because of this. Prove me wrong on that. And ladies and gentlemen, I just want to end this, and it's terrible. You know, I feel sorry for Pramatha Shala Ali and just the MCU. They'd rather have Robert Johnny Jr. be Dr. Doom and Avengers Doomsday. Come on now. It don't make no sense. That's why y'all continue to fail. I mean, what, do y'all want a female to be in this Blade? Uh Uh-huh. Female director? Is that what y'all want? Keep on taking L's. We're done. In fact, anything, this shows us that black creators, like myself, we need to have our own MCU. We need to have the BCU. Black Content Creators Cinematic Universe. We need our own. It's time. It really is. It's 2024. We need our own. We got to stop relying on them. And so I'm going to end this. Until next time, peace, love, and happiness. Stay cool. It's warm out here. And take care of yourselves and be safe. And see you later. Happy watching.